I like your attitude, man. Uh, that has been kind of thinking. So I know that I take antidepressants, right? I think mm -hmm. that's popular. You just mentioned um, SSRIs. You just mentioned those? I mentioned serotonin, which is the uh, F first S is an SSRI, yeah. Okay. Does taking SSRIs damage our brain? Well, taking SRI, SSRIs doesn't damage the serotonin neurons, but taking SR, SRIs has all kinds of bad side effects. I'm sure you know about some of them. One of the ones that is uh, most common is reducing your libido, your sexual desire. Yeah. And so yeah. the other big problem with SSRIs is they only work so-so, right? You know, actually, if you look at people who try SSRIs for depression, about a third of the people will say, oh, yeah, that works pretty good. I feel, I feel, you know, maybe not totally better, but enough that I can notice it. About a third of the people will say, oh, very minimal, just a little bit better. And about a third of people say it didn't do a thing for me mm -hmm. at all. So, you know, it's better than nothing, but SSRIs are not that great. And they're not as good as exercise. They're not as good as cognitive behavioral therapy. And whereas exercise has side effects that are good for you, SSRIs has side effects that are bad for you. I, well, it's, you know, I, it's funny you say some of this because for myself, I notice with, I've been on my thing for 20 years or something. Uh -huh. um, if I am really feeling sometimes overwhelmed, mm -hmm. I almost need to get off of them or I will lower my own dose. Really? Because sometimes I can't get feelings out of me, it feels like, yes. because they're kind of stopping it somehow. I don't know the science behind it, and I don't know if that's true, but that's how it feels to me. Does that make any sense? If it feels to you, then it's true, right? You know, I mean, everyone responds a little differently to these things.